Well, welcome to the Old Geezer's Diary. I'm down here at the Port of Felix though today on Friday. I think it's the 29th, not entirely sure. <laughs> filming um, for shipping TV, filming one of the first Triple E container vessels coming in. Because I don't think I've filmed this one since around uh, 2015. And I like to keep up to date with them in case, you know, I need the first trip. Ships occasionally have accidents, so it's handy to have some nice stock footage for that kind of thing. And it's also nice to keep up with how the, um, the ship gradually, I guess, declines over the term of years that it's at work. Don't forget these big ships don't have any holidays, they work 24 7. <laughs> At least 24 or something when you think about it because they're always underway apart from the uh i don't know probably six or seven days every month they spend alongside keys in different parts of the world a lot of people don't really understand how important shipping is to us in the uk uh, the stuff that comes to us well the story really is that 90 percent of everything we buy in our shops including food and drink comes to us from somewhere else some of it doesn't come very far like the stuff that comes in the railroad ships that go to here at Felix there and to Harwich um, that can include anything from, from steak to uh, to frozen chips um, and the stuff that comes from the far east in containers like these ones well that can include anything as well I mean classically we think of it these days as being computers and clothes and stuff but in fact um, the big container ships like this one have hundreds if not thousands of uh, plug-in circuits for frozen and shop products. So lots of that comes here from the far east as well. So in fact, what we make here, I think very much what we buy here, lots of stuff from all over the world, 90% of everything you buy in a shop comes from somewhere else other than Britain and maybe 10% of all we buy comes from here. It's a bit of a sad reflection isn't it really and it's a bit of a concern I think in the future. Um, although the future you know, is something that I'm not going to be here to see. <laughs> you have to be honest. But um, the reality, I guess, is that we do pretty well as a service economy. It would be interesting to see how we continue to do. With Brexit looming up, what a foolish man that David Cameron was. But that's just my opinion. You don't have to agree. <laughs> Who knows? Who knows what the future will hold?